Hey, hey guys, I'm coming to y'all with a quick story on Tiffany Haddish, okay? Y'all tried to cancel her. You canceled her. When she was accused of essay with the kids, and I get it, people, you know, y'all wanted to cancel her. But now she's ready. She's ready to come back to Hollywood and do her thing. But the question is, are y'all ready? We're going to get into it, everybody, right after this. <laughs> Hey, hey, guys, we want to get right into this Tiffany Haddish story. You know, Tiffany Haddish was accused of some things. Um, there was a lawsuit. The lawsuit got settled. Okay, you canceled her, but now she's ready to come back. But she's taking it slow. She's not going to be in the forefront of our face. She's going to be behind the scenes. Say hi to Tiffany, y'all. Okay, y'all wanted her gone, but she's not going away. She needs to make her money. So after some time away from the spotlight, Tiffany Haddish returns with a deal to produce new reality-based series, okay? The actress and producer makes her return to Hollywood with a new development deal with Hearst Media. Now, Hearst Media, if you never heard of them, they um, do the production of a lot of magazines. Essence Magazine is one of them, Oprah's Magazine. Um, if you look on any magazine in your, your, your supermarket or whatever, it has to do with her. So she made a deal with some people that got a little bit of money. Hey, Tiffany. All right, listen. Tiffany Harris has inked the development deal to produce two unscripted series in partnership with Hearst Media. Per an announcement, Haddish will serve as executive producer on an original series about successful women who have been involved with homeless men in on an untitled project following psychotherapist Elliot Connie. Okay, so listen, she's going to be behind the scenes, people. So are y'all at least ready to have her work behind the scenes? and not in your face? I don't know. You got to chat with me. Let me know. The collaboration comes at the Haddish took time away from highly visibly, um, um, from high visibility after being named in the SA lawsuit filed against her and comedian Aries Spears in 2022. So just last year, according to Variety, um, claimed Haddish and Spears exploited minors in a comedy sketch filmed in 2013 and 2014 for the Funny or Die platform on YouTube. The suit has since been quietly settled, according to Radar Online, and the plaintiffs released a statement addressing the incident in September 2022. So the plaintiffs say, my family and I have known Tiffany Haddish for many years. And we now know that she would never harm me or my brother or help anyone else do anything that can harm us. We wish Tiffany the best and are glad that we can all put this behind us, say, behind us said Jane Doe, according to TMC. Now, here's what's interesting, right? Um, you know, now they, 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 you, we ha they got paid off. They got paid off, and all of a sudden, everything they was accusing her of wasn't so because they got paid off. Nearly a, nearly a year later, it appears as if Haddish is ready to put the situation behind her, she says, of the new deal. So she's ready to get back to work. She said, I partnered with HMPG on these projects to make a difference in people's lives. Haddish said in a statement, I've been unhoused before and I know how hard it is to get back on your feet. That's a cute word for homeless. She said unhoused. OK, so that's the new word you got to use for homeless um, It's not homeless. It's unhoused. OK, I also know that my situation didn't define me, nor did it make me believe that I was unworthy or unlovable. Everyone deserves a chance to um, love and um, and 
to at, at love in a happy home. That's why I'm making this show. I want to use my platform to help others who are going through what I went through and give hope to those who need it most. Let's do this. She says, she ready. Again, I asked you. She may be ready, but are y'all ready for her? Tiffany is one of the most dynamic, relatable voices in economy, said Angelica Rosas McDaniel, HMPG Executive Vice President and General Manager in Entertainment. Now, let me say this about this, Angelica. You know, I give her credit because a lot of times when somebody is on down and out, when nobody wants to deal with them or work with them, it's like everybody turns their back on you. So, Angelica, kudos to you for giving Tiffany Haddish another chance. Do we not believe in second chances, guys? Can Tiffany Haddish get a second chance? Y'all let me know, okay? She said, we're thrilled to collaborate with her as we expand HMPG's general market offerings and develop these authentic, inclusive, and engaging stories we are committed to telling. Listen, the people who write this stuff, ain't they good? They use the right words. They said, engaging stories, okay? Authentic, inclusive, and engaging. Listen, guys, um, I believe in second chances. If the family that accused Tiffany Haddish of doing this, whatever they felt she did to her, dumb, and they forgave her, then all I'm asking y'all is, why can't we? So are y'all ready? That's Tiffany. Y'all talk to Tiffany, not Eva. Talk to Tiffany. Are y'all ready to give Tiffany a second chance? Listen, guys, it's going to be easier to take her in these doses because she won't be on the screen. She's going to be behind the scenes, okay? So, Tiffany, I'm going to say yes to giving you a second chance. I'm going to say yes to the path that you are taking because you're not going to be in our face that quickly. You're doing it the smart way. You're going to be behind the scenes, okay? And you're going to produce the show. And then maybe you'll wait to like 2025, 2026 before you actually get in another project and be in front of the camera. So, Tiffany, I say yes to this, but the people got to speak. And we got to ask the people what their thoughts are, okay? So thanks, Tiffany. Um, thanks, SM Magazine, for this article here. I'm going to stop sharing my screen. And y'all must know, already know the question that I'm going to ask y'all to chat with me about. Do we give Tiffany Haddish another chance in Hollywood? Are we going to forgive her? And keep in mind, before you answer this question, the people that accused her forgave her. She's ready to come back. And my question is, are y'all ready? Chat with me in the comments, guys. And when I get an opportunity, I will chat back. Don't forget to hit the like button. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that every time I upload a video, you will be notified. And all you subscribers, welcome back. And thanks for watching. See y'all in the next video, guys. Bye, Tiffany.